today I'm going to touch up on a little bit on uh, potassium iodine. What potassium iodine is, is a thyroid blocking agent in tablet form. What it does is prevents the absorption of radioactive iodine that is received through nuclear fallout. Um, in the event that there is a nuclear emergency, everyone should have these tablets beforehand, not on set. So you might want to check into um, securing a couple of these bottles for you and your family, if anything. Um, I did purchase these three years ago in 2008. And, uh, they have an expiration date here, which is 2014. So there's still a ways to go for this, but you know, you never can tell. It's better to be safe, um, especially with the news going on in Japan, hearing about their nuclear plants and uh, the crisis there. You need to be prepared. Uh, you need to study up, do research, on these particular tablets, know what they are, know what they do, um, know the dosage. Uh, this is K103, 85 megagrams, 200 tablets in each bottle. Um, each person, adults, children are going to have to take a different dosage. Um, you want to learn those very important uh, info. I also did order me at the same time the EOSAT tablets. Um, these are 130 milligrams and they're 14 tablets per package. Um, it's a thyroid blocking in a radiation emergency only. So you also want to check with your physician to see if you are allergic to any of this stuff. You want to do this ahead of time. That way you know beforehand what you can take and when, what you cannot take and what you need to avoid. Um, you don't want to do this when the uh, nuclear emergency is already out there. You want to get this uh, done as soon as possible. Uh, you want to also do a lot of uh, research and studying on, on potassium iodine um, you can find different websites that carry this tablet but from what I'm finding out is that a lot of websites are um, running out you know and or they're low on stock I checked around in our state in a lot of health food stores they're all out um, supposedly they're getting a, a new shipment this week but uh, you want to be sure to check on that and keep up on it and uh, get yourself a couple bottles here for you and your family just to be on the safe side.